Hello and welcome to the penultimate episode of the MHC for December. And this episode is due to air on Boxing Day, so I'll have to think of Christmassy things to try to do during this one. But first of all, I think I'm a little worried about where I've stopped myself. I, I backed myself right up to a wall just after dawn and I, I'm just worried that something will jump off the top of the wall and jump on my head. So as soon as I go back to the game, I'm going to run. Right, let's get underway. Right, that's better. Nothing nothing happened, it was alright. Ooh, I'm getting some jerks and jitters happening. Right, I'm sure they'll calm down after a moment. Right, so, we're on our way. We have some food, but I really would like to pick up some more. But I do have a Christmas dinner, my holiday meal, that I will uh, be eating today I hope it's the appropriate time for it all and while I go I am um, I had an idea I just a uh, oh oh whoa that was some lag spike what on earth is going on there okay right well let's uh, hope there's nothing too terrible happening there I may just have to come out of game for a moment to sort that out Okay, I'm back. I don't know quite what's causing that, but let's carry on with the game. I'm hoping that that won't be anything that's going to come back again. It was probably just some kind of a, a jitter and a jump at the beginning of the whole thing. Right, what was I saying just before that happened? I, I had an idea that maybe... I've, I've seen various people who have got themselves doggy companions during the, this uh, game and I might just get myself the one and the, my reasoning behind this is that I have got that nice meal that I can have the Christmas meal and yet it's going to be too much for me um, but if I cook that up and I have someone to share it with then you know I can eat two of the three steaks, and then my my faithful doggy can have the other one raw probably, and I think that would probably go down quite nicely, wouldn't it? Right, so I believe this is the wrong kind of forest. Do you not only see ooh, see lava evidently, but um, I think the main places where you would see wolves in the wild is in the um, spruce forests, whatever they're called. Um, right. Just wondering, is, no, 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 no. it's all worrying me at the moment. Um, I had that lag spike. I have been playing around with a couple of different settings on my uh, video before I started this session. I'm wondering whether I didn't turn something off again. And I've got, um, oh, black rabbits. I've got maybe something set a little weird and unusual. Right. Oh, look, look, food. Dark forest means food. Oh, why did you stop running just then? It was, that was not right. Right, I'm going to have this uh, red mushroom. And hopefully... Another one as well, a brown one probably, and that should at least see me right for some food for a little while to come. Now hopefully I won't get attacked if I... Yeah. Right, what I'm going to do, and this might seem strange, but I believe that I can take a mushroom down most efficiently by standing on top of it Chopping all my way round like this. I'll leave a strange inverted L shaped stone column for visitors who come around later to see and worry about. Right, I'm hoping that that is going to be a good 
efficient way of picking up as much of those as possible. Now, was there a brown mushroom anywhere? I think it goes on over there, does it not? Um, I got a boat. have a boat. I've never got a boat. The answer to that question is no, you haven't got a boat. If you, if you need to ask, then you actually haven't got one. Uh, is that rain starting? No, I don't know what's going on there. Sun's in the middle of the sky. It just seemed a little bit dimmer than normal. So we've got another uh, dark oak forest just over here. Oh, stupid boat. Oh, it even broke! That is just ridiculous. And never mind, that's what boats are like. Boats are ridiculous. So, what have I... I've got 21 of each of the types of mushroom. It's very strange. It just looks in the distance as though it should be raining. weird. Just interesting the way that tree and that mushroom have intersected with each other. Right. Good, good, good. Right. So now I'm, I'm much too high on the red mushrooms and uh, not well enough on the brown at the moment, so it would be nice if I could find some way around that, but there doesn't seem to be a brown mushroom anywhere in sight, does there? No, in this little patch we don't seem to have any. Now in old Minecraft, that, a drop like that into shallow water would have actually hurt me, wouldn't it? So, let's stop for a moment and make up some mushy food, and I'll get on my way again. What I'd like to do would be, if I can keep up a good pace, by the end of the whole thing, 20,000 from home will be quite an achievement, I think, for me. Um, I know it won't win, people will have gone a lot further than that, I don't mind. It's, it's all about what I can achieve in this thing. Horses, yes, that would have been nice at one point, but I've gone off the whole idea of horses. Now, this might seem a bit wasteful of my energy to be running up the hill so high. But I just want to see the surrounding area a little bit and um, see if we've got some of these trees around. It would be really nice if there was a place where there might be some wolves. So, there we go. Um, yes. It's a story that I'm kind of building up. And of course, now I've thought of it, I want it to happen. Ooh. That's rather a scary valley. Terrible drops and things going on down here. Oh, <laughs> The rabbit took the terrible drop. Right. Please don't worry about too many noises in the background. It's just normal household things going on. Proof that I do live in the real world. And not the that castle. Right, let's get through these. These are just a little bit difficult to traverse and are causing me a bit of pain to get through. Slow me down. Ah, right. That's beginning to look much more like a... It's beginning to look a lot like... No. Um, beginning to look a lot like a place where you might find a wolf. 
See, I've only got four bones though, so there's always the chance that I'll just go through those bones and there won't be any wolves for me. Lots of high hills, I'm up to 16,000 blocks, I've now got a big drop. Have I got a water bucket? Yes I have, so if necessary I could do that. And you can take your jumps that way. Are we coming down to night time? Yes we are. And I'm on top of the highest hill. <laughs> right. oh, I don't know whether that comes out on the recording, but it's really nice. The, the sound of the snow under your feet as you run across them. I can hear that. Right, okay, so we've got more mountainside. We're crossing. And... Um, it's just you see plains, really. So I'm, I'm not sure whether this doggy idea is really going to come off. Um, but what I'll do is I'll just carry on running, run through the night as we do, and try not to get into any terrible trouble. Right. Let's try a little water drop. There we go, that got me. Ooh, what's happening? Ah, that's very strange. Caught in a... Uh, a bit of completely cheaty water down there. I'm glad that evened itself out. Sorted itself out. Right, run, run, run! Away you go. Heading towards the moon. Creepers are out. The zombies are out. Goodness me, would you believe? I was only in the last episode saying that there were no jungles, there were no warmer terrain been spotted in this whole series and I, I wasn't aware from any of the videos that I'd um, viewed myself as well that there was a, any jungle anywhere. What is, I wonder what jungle will mean to me. If, I, if there's a jungle there, is that, is that something I could use? I don't know. I doubt it. I think I'll just try and run past it. Don't really fancy the um, the kind of leaf lag that you're likely to get there as well. Go straight away into colder, high hills, extreme hills with... Yeah. Right. Do not fall down the holes. Do not look at the Enderman. Life is all about rules. I'm starting to get a bit hungry. better. Right, more high hills. I think if I can get up to maybe 18,000, I mean 18,000 on this episode would be really good. Oh, he shot me. Yeah, shot me. Well, of course he does. That's what they do. It's, it's only natural. There's so many things that I wish I'd been able to do in this series. I, I feel as though I've, I've led a very frugal and bare existence in, in this challenge where I've not had, not had enchantments, I've not had, um, not been to the nether. You know, I suppose well, I have had one enchantment, haven't I? Uh, I found that book. I fished it. I fished a book out of the river one day and it was a feather falling and I dare say that has really helped my progress. So 17,000 up now. If I can manage another thousand during the night... I, <laughs> I love the way that the zombies are just so stupid now that you can you can run straight past them. They, they go one way, you go the other. <laughs> it's hilarious. Uh, that's not so hilarious. There's a baby zombie around. They are never hilarious. Right, up in the trees, so we can have a better look what's going on. Down we go. It's interesting the way that even with... Oh, that's a ravine. I do not like 
to fall into deep ravines. Yeah, the um Ah creepy He exploded. So late. That was just crazy. He should not have been exploding that late because I should have been well out of range. So, the run through the night. I can't even remember what I was saying just before that happened. Spidey. Haha, <laughs> Spidey couldn't even... Uh, ouch. Do they shoot each other or something? Oops. Right, I'm starting to get a bit on the hungry side. I think probably time for me to jump into a tree, is it? it? Ooh, do I want to go there? Ow! Four. I'm so close! Beat him to death with your food bowl. He's still trying to get to me. Yeah! Death to you, mate. Right. Okay. Let's make a little more food while we're up in this tree. Good. Get myself back. Oh, I realise I probably could have um, used that as my moment to cook up. Is this actually the moment? Should I... Up in the roof of a tree, I should cook my um, steak. And the next time I get really hungry while it's still the same day, you know, I'll, I'll scarcely have a chance, but I can... I can get myself really hungry. Hello, is he just a, is someone just about to attack me? I'm sure he is. I can hear him splattering his little feet around below. Where's he gone? Right, there's my Christmas meal. Holiday meal, ready to be had. And... <laughs> spider. So, let's shake him off. Big jump. Okay. Oh, baby, 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 baby. Uh. Wow. It's not exciting until you've had a baby zombie at your throat. Right, on we go. I'm trying to get myself really hungry, and hopefully I will be able to settle down and have a nice, rich, Christmassy meal at the end of the day. Just as sunrise comes, I think that will be what it is. Assuming I don't plunge down a ravine. I don't like these dense forests. They're actually probably better if you can get up on the, the treetops. Oh look. It's um, getting close to uh, the rivers, no, the, what do you call it, the edge of the ocean. Okay, sun is beginning to rise. I'm still not quite hungry enough to have my Christmas meal, but... Uh... Oh my god! That's not nice. Oh! That hurt. <laughs> that propelled me. Right. So I think. Just. Ooh, that's not good. Get away from the bad guys, just for a moment. I'm not sure I need a boat anyway at this moment. Look, what's, what's it? Witch's Night Out or something? Sun begins to rise. Now, I can 
can just get myself a boat while I'm here on the shore. Right, looks like I might be having a late um, Christmas meal this time. It might be into the next episode because I'm just not going to be hungry enough to eat it. So it'll be in the last episode. I'm looking now to see whether we tick round from day seven to day eight. And it's, um, there I am, that is day eight. I've not quite made it to the 18,000, so I'll, I'll actually carry on up to shore. And as I get to shore, we are just about going to be there at the 18,000, just a few seconds into. There we are, 18,000. I'm into the last day, and I'll stop there, and that's the end of episode number eight. Please come back next time. Goodbye.